Hello everyone, and boy do I have a heck of a walkthrough for you here. My name is PK Gam, and I will be commentating the whole thing from start to finish. Oh man, when I first played this game, like when I got so and so far through the game, I was like, oh I know I'm gonna make a walkthrough on this game. This game is a game. Yeah, I know, I'm <laughs> just being just a little silly here, but uh, this game is very artistic, very mysterious, like there's a lot of stuff about the game's story that is up for interpretation, there's uh, a whole lot of stuff to find, it's just my kind of game. <laughs> and as you probably guessed from the title of this video. It is of Shadow of the Colossus for the PlayStation 2. Now, I'm not doing the PlayStation 3 remake because, well, I don't have it. <laughs> I just have a PlayStation 2, don't, have, don't even have a PlayStation 3, so yeah, that's so why I'm doing the original here, but it should help you with the remake as well, so yeah. Of course, if you're going to complain about, like, oh no, the graphics is so, so much worse in the older one than the newer one, and well, I, I can't please you in that regard. <laughs> but really, this game is pretty beautiful as is, and you know, graphics doesn't, uh, graphics don't make a game anyway, you know, it's, it's mostly about the gameplay more than anything, and then everything else comes second, at least in my opinion. And this game definitely has it. Um, it's an adventure game, but what's unique about it is that there is no regular enemies throughout the entire game. I mean, yeah, there is stuff to kill and stuff to collect, but it's nothing that will attack you. It's only bosses, basically. It's pretty interesting, and you'll see as we get into it. Just watch a few parts, and I think you will be quite impressed at this game. Go into the light! Go... No, it actually, that's, that's a bad idea. No, no, actually, it's a good idea. <laughs> if you wouldn't go into the light, we wouldn't have a game. And speaking of he, who is he? His name is Wander, and he's riding his horse named Agro. Why is he going all the way over there across this incredibly expansive bridge? Well, I guess we'll find out. And when I say expansive, I mean expansive. Just look at the size of this thing, and quite literally, as far as you can see, this is stuff that's explorable. You know, down below the bridge there, it's a huge game to explore, and I love exploring. And here we are at the title screen for, yep, Shadow of the Colossus. Let's get a new game started here, and I'm probably gonna end up cutting out these black loading circle screens, uh, but you know, if I'm if I end up talking through them. Uh, I, I won't cut it out because I'll hit, I'm typically, when I talk through stuff like that, it's because I'm in a chain of thought. <laughs> so, yeah. Alright, so it looks like he has arrived at the end of the bridge. That had to have taken him hours. <laughs> and so, we appear to be at some sort of building shrine of ancientness thingy. That has a garage door that you can park your horse in. No, <laughs> it houses a staircase. Well, maybe not so much houses a staircase as it is prevents people from getting in said staircase. As if, you know, it's a door. It protects things. Keeps things in or out. Or I, I don't know what I'm saying here. <laughs> Just, again, being silly. It's what I do. Hmm. Man, this place is pretty big. Yeah, really big. 
That's gonna take a long while to traverse down to the bottom of this spiral pathway. Oh, I'm so glad they cut ahead. <laughs> hey, 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 calm down there, Agro. It's alright. It's alright. We're on solid ground now. So it was a shrine. A shrine with a garage door. <laughs> a bunch of statues. Pretty cool looking statues, I have to say. Mm -hmm. Hey, what's that on the back there? Let's, yeah, what's in the bag? Get, come on, show the people what's in the bag. Oh, it looks like a person. Who is this person? What? What? Why is he carrying her? This is weird. Oh, artistic camera angle. This game has an awesome presentation. But you'll see as we get into it. Like I said before. It appears to be a girl, and her name is Mono. Clearly something happened to her, because she's not moving. I'm so happy there's a translation, because I don't understand that. <laughs> Hmm. Backstory, obviously. Was you a Dilaz also? Few hours is in the color kids are though you love. So perhaps that's why Wander is there. Oh. Oh. Why is it forbidden, anyway? I mean, if you can bring back the souls of the dead, that sounds like a good thing, right? And you're like, don't tamper with nature, or something like that, and then they just lock the door, they shut the garage door. <laughs> oh. Oh boy, this is getting creepy. I think we found out why it's forbidden. Huh? Huh? Hmm? The Master Sword! No, it's not. <laughs> but there's definitely something special about this sword. Very special, actually. Hmm. Storms are brewing. That's never a good sign. I do believe I possess it. Ah, sounds like we found the right guy. 
Is Kyunku Idus Arodo you Iweriko? Oh, it's no old amusement. A rude click if the least do is. And now we know what happened to her. I refuse to accept that. That's why I'm here. I'm waiting for him to say that. No, he doesn't say that. <laughs> oh! Really? So again, something to do with the sword. I should say that the sword was brought up again. No problem. I will bet. Destroy them? But they're works of art! Well, I guess if it's for the girl. You have some dynamite on hand? That would, that would be pretty nice. Just all of them at once. And there we go. Oh. Guess I should have waited till you started. You know, with the explanation. It was rude of me to not let him finish. If you count them, there are 16 of them, in fact. 16 Colossus. Well, Colossi. <laughs> so, I guess the individual Colossus are connected to said statues. Oh. oh, come on, it's for the girl. I gotta save the girl. I've done it many times before in other games. I can do it here. 